Hi, welcome back to Bernat.com. Today we're going to be talking about Bernat, knit or not, Jessie. Jessie is a nice, gorgeous group of specialty yarns, and we're, we have two patterns that you can make with this. There's a knit version and a knot version. Today we're going to be making the knot version, but I'm going to show you what the knit version looks like. The knit version sort of makes this fun, really special, eclectic looking scarf. And we do have a video tutorial that you can watch on our website. You can check it out there. So that's Jesse. But today what we're going to be making is this knotted scarf. It's really simple. The only techniques you need to know are how to tie a knot and we're going to be doing a little bit of wrapping, but that's all there is to it. So we're going to get together the supplies that we need and then we'll get started. So we need a hank of Knit or Not Jesse yarn and a pair of scissors. Okay, so now that we have our supplies, what we're gonna wanna do is we're gonna wanna take our yarn out of our packaging and basically you just wanna try to carefully open it and not tear it because on the back of this label is your patterns for what you're making. If you do tear it or you've thrown it away, it's not a big deal, we do have those patterns online. So you're gonna see that your yarn is tied in three spots. So basically that's just to hold it together to keep it from tangling. But we wanna leave those on right for the next moment. And what we wanna do is separate a couple strands of yarn, three to five strands from the grouping. To do that, you kinda of wanna just hold it in one hand, grab a strand and pull it out and basically those ties kind of keep that all in place. So again I'm going to pull another strand. Let's see if we can show you one that's a little bit more fuzzy to show you that this is how easy it is. Yep, there we go. We're pulling one of these eyelash ones out. Okay, so now we have a bunch of strands, three to five strands. And we want to go ahead and take the ties off of our yarn here. So you just want to take your scissors and go ahead and clip off those ties. We don't need them anymore. Okay. And then the next thing you want to do is you want to take those yarns that you just pulled out and kind of gather them all together. So just kind of put all the ends, ends together so that you can kind of work with them as one strand. So from the top of your loop of yarn, you want to eye a piece about maybe 12 inches from the top, 12 inches to about there. And then all you want to do is take your strands and wrap them around all the yarn and just tie a basic knot. Pretty simple. You want to leave a yarn tail so that it kind of blends in. You're about six to eight inches long. You can tie a double knot if you'd like to hold it secure. And then what you want to do is just kind of gather up this grouping of yarn and you just kind of want to wrap it around because what we're going to do is we're going to wrap it around, wrap it around, wrap it until we get to the same spot on the other side. So here I'm just going to show you a few wraps. Make sure you get all your strands. And then every couple wraps, you just kind of want to give the yarn a little tug to tighten it up so you get a nice tight wrap around it. And then you want to keep going. So basically, again, you want to wrap it all the way around to the other side, 12 inches down. Now I have a sample that already has that step almost done. And I'll show you what you do after you're finished wrapping. So as you can see, this one has been wrapped tightly all the way around and I have what's left in my yarn tail. And I'm just going to wrap it around and again, just kind of tie it into a knot to kind of hold it in place. You just want to tighten that up and there you go. So the next step that I want to do is I want to take those two knotted parts and put them together and then you want to separate a couple strands, again three to five strands from one side and you want to just wrap them around those two knots securing both sides to each other. 
So again, you just wrap it around three or four times. And you want to secure the whole thing with a knot. And then that's it. You're done. Basically, you've made your keyhole and you want to take it and this is how you wear it. You want to loop it around your neck and you want to take your yarn tails and pull it through that keyhole you've made. And you can adjust it and there you go. You've got your Jesse Knit or Knot scarf completed. So that's it for today and I hope to see you again at Bernat.com.